So yeah, this girl was really mean to Eugenia. Laugh in the fast lane, we play our cards Pray and we'll find out just who we are Bitch, I've been a king What up everyone, it's your boy, Martin Lewis It's your boy, Martin Lewis Martin Lewis Boy, Martin Lewis what up everyone, it's your boy Martin Lewis Team Real, welcome to Drama 2 where we call out fake ass YouTubers and talk about YouTube drama. So as you guys know, there's been a huge storm between Eugenia with people just basically picking on her and a lot of other things on you now. So let's get straight into the drama. So for you guys who don't know who Eugenia Cooney is, she's basically a YouTuber, a lifestyle, I would say a beauty YouTuber, but does a little bit of vlogs and Q&As and funny stuff like that. She started on You Now back in the day. I remember I was on You Now when she was on and um, from there, she made a video that went viral and I believe it was the twerking video that went viral. Years later, people started to really question her about her weight because she started to get a lot more more skinnier than usual. One of them being Onision, he basically made a lot of videos towards her and a lot of Onision fans started to attack her. There were even petitions going on to take her off YouTube, which I think is bullshit because let's say she did have a health issue like anorexia for example, then it's really sad to take someone's money away when that money could be going towards treatment and for all we know, maybe she is paying for treatment and we don't know about it, you know? She's also been invited to be on the Dr. Phil and you know what Dr. Phil would have done. We're going. I don't want to go to a program. Mom and Dad. And another doctor show talked about it. It was quite interesting to get a doctor perspective because, you know, they're professional apparently so they would know what they're talking about and this is what they said. I feel for her, I but... She does not look good. I mean, from a professional standpoint, she she looks like she needs help. I mean, that, I mean, she really looks emaciated. You know, I hope she, she seeks help for what well, it's one. Regardless, we have no idea what's going on because we're not in her life. We don't know what she does. And yeah, it's just hard to pinpoint exactly what she has. But obviously, there's something there that she's not talking about. And maybe it's because it's personal and she's getting treatment and she doesn't want to talk about it. Or maybe because she does have an issue. Maybe she doesn't have anything. You know, there's just not enough receipts. Obviously, there's something going on. But anyway. So, it started with trolls. Okay, trolls are not too bad. Trolls are quite funny. I even laugh at trolls. Some trolls are not trolls. They're just basically bullies and they call themselves trolls. But they kind of act like trolls. This is a troll that was basically getting her to say stuff that were was degrading her but without realizing it. Check it out. Thank you, Rachel. Um, why do you ignore me? No, my mama is a whale. <laughs> my mama's a whale. Like, Eugene is so polite. She's really good with communicating with her audience on you now. She has really good present skills. She knows how to make people feel special and she always reads out the names so they knew this and they kind of took advantage of her and started putting stupid names here's some more um i am definitely not trying to ignore you i'm sorry i um, need to see everything probably it's because i'm stupid and i don't see everything but i'm always trying my best to reply so i'm very sorry i'm definitely not trying to ignore you if you were a potato, you'd be a good potato. Oh, thank you, Felma Rare. <laughs> Did you cry when Buttercree left? Oh my gosh, yes! My, my mom is a whale. Uh, right, my mama is a whale. Um. <laughs> <laughs> this is just so funny, man. This is like my fifth time watching it and I still laugh. My wife is expecting your first child and I'm gonna call her Eugenia in your honor. Oh my gosh, I have a meaty pussy. <laughs> Interesting name. Uh, exactly, they do make you stronger, Kayla. Um, whoa, I have a meaty pussy. <laughs> she's <laughs> she's <hit> it again. <laughs> Does she not know what she's reading? Um, thank you for. She's getting nervous there. She's playing with her hair. She's not. She's like, oh shit, what am I? <laughs> um, 
my girlfriend is gonna make a band called Flaming Foodies because you inspired her to make emo music. Oh my gosh, my mom eats my food. <laughs> oh my god, my mom eats my food. Holy shit. If you guys do that to me on you now and record it, I would fucking laugh. Like, that shit's funny. Um, alright, cool. Um, One day, Eugenia decides to guess this girl who looks like Ronald McDonald's daughter. Check it out. Okay, I have a couple more questions. Go for it. Um. One second. <laughs> Oh yeah, no problem. Don't worry. I can't my work brain, on TV. But my brain's it's totally okay. Don't worry. Um, are you aware that you influence younger girls to uh, stop eating, and they end up like, like getting really sick? Um, who? Hey, you know, um, I have like heard, you know, a lot of people say that, but you know, um, I really like, I don't ever try to like promote anything at all. Like, I just really try to like, you know, tell people, like, I literally tell people not to try to be me or like to, to look like me or anything like that. Like, I always really try to like make that like clear to people. And um, I know, like, I don't know if like you've seen like and that is true. Eugenia doesn't go around saying, "Hey guys, look at me." I remember when I was on you now, and one day someone said that they wanted to look at like her because they were big and Eugenia told them to love themselves and be like no don't look like me love yourself be comfortable in the body that you're moving so you're in so I know she's not influencing people people if kids watch her and they choose to do whatever they want to do that's their choice you know what I mean she's not influ how can it, it how's it her responsibility to be oh yeah you got this many followers you're influencing, it's, it's not like she's telling people to look like her. You feel me? Was one video going around though, where someone said, I'm the same size as you. And she goes, yay, you're the same size as me. I don't know why she didn't. I don't think she did it as in, yeah, come skinny like me. I think she did it as in, oh, someone's the same size. Like, I don't know, maybe she was trying to find justification to be like, see, I'm not the only one this size. But I don't think she does it. There's, there's no proof or evidence of her promoting to be her size, to be her weight. You feel me? If you're gonna try to ban her for being that weight, then you need to ban any YouTuber who's a little bit fat. You need to ban people who are overweight on YouTube. People's videos, because I, I do know that like some people have made like videos. Oh, like Anision's videos? Yeah, yeah, his yeah. and you know, he's kind of, I think, like, the main person that kind of even got, like, people to start saying that. But, you know, like, I don't know. Like, I literally, like, my videos, I don't even ever try to um, promote, like, anything. I don't promote, like, how to lose weight, how to, like, have a body like mine or, like, anything like that. I don't, like, I don't even, like, talk about that stuff. So, um. Yeah. Well, I think you're yeah. gorgeous. Oh, thank you, Kuhei Kira. Well, you are gorgeous, too. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, all of a sudden, she gets possessed by the devil, and she says this. That's no worries. I think you'd probably be a little prettier if you weren't dying. Out of my face! Out of my face! Uh, Look at her, she's being like all smirk about it. Like, it's really irritating me. Oh, uh, okay, well, um, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm alive right now, but, you know... I don't know, but but thank you for saying I'm gorgeous, I guess. Um, you're a gorgeous person, so you know, I think that you're gorgeous no matter what, but... And see, so Eugenia, <laughs> I think she's laughing about it too, but at the same time, she's being very polite. Yeah. Alright, I gotta go take my little sister to school. But thank you for guessing okay. me! Yeah, no problem! Um, have fun with you, taking your sister to school. I will. Bye! Alright, bye! Okay, um, alright, well, she was nice, um, sorry, I feel a little bit awkward right now, kind of, the question kind of caught me a little bit off guard, so, I wasn't really expecting that, so I'm a little bit, like, um, surprised, but, so and look, guys, I decided that I will Skype call Eugenia and teach her to have a backbone, you know, she can't let these little kids just walk all over her like that, so today, we're gonna Skype her, and we're gonna teach her how to be tough. What's up, Eugenia? Oh, uh, hey, Martin. 
Okay, man, look, I know this little redhead McDonald girl was, like, trying to bully you and stuff. So, look, I'm going to teach you to have a backbone, okay? Uh, thanks, Martin. You don't need to do that for me. I don't care. We're going to do it anyway. So, repeat after me. What you looking at, bitch? What are you looking at, bitch? My boy pussy, bitch. Right over there, my boy pussy. Meow. Eat my boy, bitch. Perfect. That's exactly what you need to do. Next time she comes on, you got her. Imagine if Eugenia wasn't a nice person and she took, didn't take people's shit. I think you'd probably be a little prettier if you weren't dying. Uh, okay, well, um... <laughs> okay, well, you're just an ugly, fat bitch who's jealous because you can't look like me. And your hair, it looks like fucking period hair or something. So eat my boy. Meow. But honestly, I do think it's really sad that people try to take advantage of take advantage of that situation. To me, it looked like she was trying to get attention some way by looking into the camera and saying that. Yeah, it's just really sad and pathetic to see people do that. I'm guessing, I, she looks young, she's probably 18, 16, I don't know her age, but yeah, it's really, it's pretty mean to do stuff like that. Hey guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below, give this video a big thumbs up, and make sure to subscribe, because if you don't, that redhead girl, when you're sleeping and you wake up, she's going to be staring at you at the end of your bed, just like that. <laughs> So make sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell so you get notified. And give this video a like because it does help me out a lot. Thank you so much guys for watching. Salute and peace.